Living jewels swim in hundreds, thousands of plastic bags on bamboo sticks. The Chanjing Chamber of Recreational Fisheries is a market that opens every Thursday after midnight. Waiting for his fish to dock, Wu has come for a little distraction. And shortly, he has found his favorite. Fish here are of surprisingly high quality and competitively priced too. Wu sees possibilities for breeding even better lines of unique guppy. At 1 a.m., Wu sees his fish come in. They have spent two days longer at sea than expected. Wu is beside himself with worry. The moment has come. Each bag is examined, one by one. Oh, the guppy's listless behavior shows how long they've been packed up. If they don't bounce back, it will be disappointing. Wu is a realist. There's nothing to do but press on. In Atlanta, Georgia, American pet supply chain Sun Pet bought black zebra angelfish from Taiwanese breeder J.Y. Lin. After less than a day, the angelfish are going to a pet store in downtown Atlanta. These black zebra angelfish left J.Y. Lin 27 hours ago. Really nice. Now they enter a new tank halfway around the world. Their journey is nearly done. Their next trip will be from here to a home in the Atlanta area, if someone buys them. That probably won't be long. Angelfish are among the world's most popular ornamental fish. Angelfish in general are our top selling fish just because they are such a peaceful large fish. They do get quite large so they can be a showpiece in an aquarium. Hey guys, how are you? Thank you, how are you? I'm fine. How are you today? So what brings you here? A father and his son arrive. So what do you think you're they are in the market for new inhabitants for their home aquarium. Something of different body style. Okay. Southern community. That'll work with all the fish, definitely. Okay, all right. Let's take a look down here. It's coming to the store every week and pick out a new fish, come home, put it in the tank, and then it's a whole different tank. It looks nicer. Mm -hmm. 
something catches their eyes. Could this be love at first sight? In Chanjing, China, many eyes are on the World Guppy Contest. Competitors from 15 nations have entered specimens, and the judges are assessing fins, patterns, and overall vitality. Points build up. So does the tension. Soon, the judges will name a champion. The judging goes on behind closed doors. The competitors have to wait outside, pacing away their nervous energy. We have 700 tanks, so that would be uh, rare if there weren't champions within it. They are very good fish. But, uh, they are very good. There's a high, high level, high quality here in the show. I think over the last 20 years, Taiwan has made uh, significant strides in producing top quality guppies. I've been very impressed with what many of their breeders have been able to do and the quality of fish that they've developed in the recent years. So I very much like uh, the Taiwan guppies. The tallying has taken place. In each category, there will be a few winners and many, many losers. Wu Qinghong is eager to be among the winners announced tomorrow.